Hello everyone and welcome to our first campsite review. Back in June of 2020, Christine and I decided to do a short social distance getaway. Since all our other campground reservations had been canceled, we decided to try staying at the Muskrat Lake State Forest Campground between Mayo and Lewiston, Michigan. State Forest Campgrounds in Michigan differ from the State Park Campgrounds and most all of them are first come, first served and do not take reservations. They usually will not have any type of hookups at the sites, so you are rustic or dry camping and need to be self-contained. Each site does have a picnic table and fire ring, and most of the state forest campgrounds will have a pit or vault toilet and potable water from a well pump. The campsites are $15 per night, and you pay on site at a lock box provided when you arrive. You also need a Michigan State Park Recreational Passport. Muskrat Lake is good for canoeing, kayaking, and fishing. The campground has 13 sites, two of which will accommodate a 40-foot vehicle or trailer. We stayed in Site 12, which I think was one of the nicest sites there is, as it had a beautiful view of the lake. There were five to six other campers when we arrived Friday morning, and by Saturday the campground was full. There are a lot of Amish in the area, so you need to keep an eye out for their horses and buggies. They do frequent the park to go fishing on the lake. campground also provides quick access to the off-road ORV trails, which we took part of with our side-by-side. -side. While we were out exploring the area, we found what looked like a small pet cemetery out in the woods and some bear tracks on the far side of the lake. One of the other area attractions include the Coopersville Old West Town. This is a recreated ghost town that is free to visit and has several artifacts and quirky exhibits. If you come in the fall, the Tea Lake Resort puts on an awesome Halloween display that you can walk through and enjoy. I hope you enjoyed this short campground review. We both would like to thank you for watching.